The vascular service line here at New York Presbyterian Hospital is a collection of all the different physicians from the various specialties that all provide care for vascular disease. Now that includes vascular and endovascular surgery, interventional radiology, cardiac surgery, cardiology, and interventional neuroradiology uh, as well. Within those specialties, we provide care for the full spectrum of vascular disorders, both involving arteries uh, and veins. So there are a variety of ways as a patient uh, to be seen by members of the vascular service line. You can either go individually to directly to a physician if there's somebody that you're interested in seeing uh, specifically, or on our website you can also find phone numbers uh, where you can be referred to the appropriate specialist within the vascular service line. Within the vascular service line, we're very involved in research, both basic science and clinical research. We're looking at innovative ways to track and improve our outcomes. We're looking at studying the various clinical forms of care for vascular disorders. And most importantly, we're very interested and very uh, heavily involved in investment in development of new and innovative technology to make treatment of vascular disorders and patients safer and more effective. As a teaching hospital, uh, we are involved in patient care, first and foremost. We're involved in education of medical students and physician leaders of the future, and we're also involved in research, both basic science and clinical research. As a teaching center, we really provide kind of a unique environment where all of those things can be combined to improve the care of vascular patients. It doesn't mean that there's an inferior level of care. Uh, on the contrary, I think that that uh, brings a renewed focus, new technology, innovation uh, into the clinical arena. We have tremendous excellence in multiple different areas with a wealth of experience in treatment of even uncommon and complex vascular disorders. We actually uh, also have access to innovative and new technologies through clinical research trials that may not be available at a smaller community hospital. We treat the gamut of all vascular disorders, whether it's uh, straightforward uh, vascular disorders or even uh, more complex. And the benefit of being at a large uh, teaching uh, institution uh, is that when something is complex, there's always somebody here with some expertise in that area so that we can make certain that we're providing outstanding care. Some of the research and, uh, and innovation that we're involved with here at New York Presbyterian Hospital is the development of less invasive or minimally invasive or also called endovascular technologies. That we try to do a lot of things without making any incision. Endovascular means inside the vessel or within the blood vessel. So using small uh, or tiny catheters, a lot of times now we can treat vascular disorders without making any incisions whatsoever uh, using uh, catheter techniques and um, uh, sophisticated forms of guidance uh, in order to get those catheters to the blood vessels where they need to work and to treat uh, whatever problem we're working on. So whenever possible, we're using and we're developing these minimally invasive techniques so we can lessen the magnitude of what the patient has to go for, uh, through but also provide effective treatments for their vascular disease.